Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to take the pictures from your iPhone, and I don't know if this works on iPod Touch, so you can just try it. Take them from your iPhone, I can guarantee, to your computer without having to email them to yourself or anything. You're going to need your phone, your sync cable, and your computer. First, you've got to plug your phone into the cable. And then plug the USB into your computer. And it might start to sync, it doesn't matter. And then let me try to zoom this in. I don't know how well the video is going to look, but you'll get the idea. Okay, um, hit the start menu in the corner, and then hit computer on the list. And then your iPhone should pop up. Here's mine. And you go into it. And then this disc thing right here. Okay, it's in the camera. Um, this should pop up. Click it, open it. And then DCIM will pop up. And they change their file systems all the time. But it's basically the same. You might have multiple files. I don't know. But it's all basically the same format. And then open the folders and search through and to create a folder and save those, go to your start menu again, hit pictures. It doesn't have to be in pictures, but anywhere you want, right click, go to new, go over and hit folder. And it'll create a new folder and then type in whatever you want to call it. I'm just going to call it iPhone. And then double click and open that folder. It's currently empty. And back on the bottom bar, just go back to your um, iPhone pictures and click on whatever ones you want to transfer over. And if you want to select several, you can you hold down the control key and you click on all the ones that you want to transfer and to select like if there's five next to each other or something that you want to get you click the mouse hold the mouse and drag it over all of them all the ones that you want and then let go of the control key click and hold on one of the pictures that you selected drag it down to your iPhone folder um, and let it go and it'll take a few seconds to transfer or a few minutes depending on what all you're trying to transfer and now you can see that it's done and I just transferred some random pictures I don't even know what they are now you can take your um, iPhone disconnect it and just and it'll take the iPhone one away but here's all the pictures you saved and they're still fully accessible even though my phone's not plugged in, so now they're officially on my computer. So, um, if you like this video, please comment, um, rate, and subscribe. And I don't like to be one of those people that beg for subscribers, but I'm trying to get, um, the partnership program, so if you guys can please subscribe, then that'd be great. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next videos.